A bill that would make almost all abortions illegal in Arkansas passed through a Senate committee today and will make its way to the Senate floor next week. Five News reporter Catherine Gilker explains the bill and has reaction from both sides of the political aisle. Senate Bill 6 is the Arkansas Unborn Child Protection Act to abolish abortion in Arkansas. Abortion, as you will read in SB 6, is a crime against humanity in which over 62 million innocent babies have been killed in our nation. And we believe it's important now at this moment to take a stand. In fact, it's past time. Senator Jason Rapert is a sponsor of the bill. A similar bill was signed into law in 2019 called the Abortion Trigger Bill. He says this new bill creates a challenge directly to Roe v. Wade. The difference is that we, by language in the bill, we now are saying we immediately abolish all abortion in our state except to save the life of the mother. You can currently only get an abortion in Arkansas up to 20 weeks of pregnancy with a few exceptions. Fayetteville Senator Greg Letting says he will be voting against the bill. We just think it is the wrong thing to do here in Arkansas. No matter what your opinion on this issue might be, uh, this is a choice that needs to be made by women. And it is a choice that will be made by women uh, regardless of what happens with this particular bill. The Planned Parenthood Clinic in Little Rock is one of the few places in the state carrying out abortions. Gloria Pedro with Planned Parenthood Great Plains says they are opposed to this bill. She says it's another piece of unconstitutional legislation that's attempting to prevent access to safe legal abortion in Arkansas. It's wasting time and taxpayer money with a publicity stunt. Um, SB 6 is basically a demand letter to the Supreme Court and the um, courts are separate from uh, the legislature for a reason. This is the equivalent of a demand letter and that's just not how any of this works. Covering news where you live, Katherine Gilker, 5 News. Senate Bill 6 will be heard before the entire Arkansas Senate next week. Tomorrow's session was canceled because of the weather.